Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bex. I am a part-time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. I do sell on other platforms, but Poshmark and eBay are my main two focuses. I am here doing an unboxing. I placed an order with Pittsburgh Mike for a hundred denim wholesale lot. And he sent four for free since I ordered a hundred. I have received the second half officially. I did a part one already for the first 52 pairs. This is the next 52 pairs. So let's go ahead and start unboxing it, shall we? I like unboxing it with you guys. So you know, like I haven't even looked at it. I haven't really done my research quite yet. Partly because I like to see what I can recognize and what I feel I know. The first pair. 515 jeans by Levi's. These look like Bermuda shorts. Let's see what size these are. Size 14, dark wash. Size 14, it sells pretty good for me. But these might not sell for a couple months. So I will keep that in mind. It won't be one of the first things I'll be listing. But I'll still make my money. I like getting Levi's a lot. They sell like butter, like it's awesome. All right, we have Carter BKE Denim, size 31, dark wash, feels like men's, has the, the thick pockets. I sold a pair of BKE men's jeans, I believe for $25, $28 a couple weeks back. I need to double check my my number on that but these are a very popular brand this is a very 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 nice wash I really like those back pockets um, let's see we have Maurice's medium women's capris I really like that sandblasting looks really good on camera <laughs> but we have dress and capris Had some cute pockets. <laughs> Levi's size four, light wash capris. There we go. We have Super skinny, low waist, size 28, H&M, skinny jeans. Nice, medium dark wash, I would say. Oh, still dark wash, but it's not as dark as some of the other ones. You know, I don't have a pair of H&M jeans in my closet yet, so this will be fun to, to see what I get. We have a medium wash, men's, I can already feel it. Oh no, these could be women's, let's see. Size 22W, Riders by Lee, instantly slims you, medium stone 22W, yep. Trying to, there we go. I'm excited. I like selling 22W, it sells really well on eBay. Poshmark, not so much. Poshmark, I uh, sell really good in the smaller sizes, not quite like twos and zeros, but like smaller than the um, plus size. Plus size is awesome for eBay. We have it, it's like a, Exclamation mark, and that says it. Hmm. Comment down below if you've ever heard of that. That's interesting. I've never heard of this brand. Has the little it on the on the pocket too. All right. So this is. Hmm. Curvy stiletto, size twenty eight, women's. Yup. Got the skinny. Dark wash. I love dark wash and it sells the best for me. I sell a lot of dark wash on Poshmark. It's trending. We have Riders 
by Lee, mid-rise Bermuda shorts, dark wash, size 12M. Nice, very nice. But I'm going to probably wait to list all of those Bermuda shorts and capris, like I said, until after I've listed all of the jeans, just because of the season. Still going to list them during the season, but not in a rush to. We have Air Postal designed in NYC boot cut. It's like a medium wash. Let's see if I can find the size. 12 long. I really, really like that stone, that sandblast wash. The whiskering, that looks nice. We have another pair of Bermuda shorts. Well, maybe not Bermuda. Levi size 14, relaxed shorts 550. There we go. All right. I know I'm like singing a lot in between these. <laughs> Ooh, stretchy waist. Got some embroidery on these. Elizabeth by Liz Claiborne, size 16. It has the, the stretchy waist, it has the embroidered pockets, that looks nice. Got the Liz Claiborne. I don't know if you can see that very well. Here we are. Medium wash. I like the embroidery on it. That's what's actually making me like those pants. It's just the embroidery. <laughs> All right. I, ooh, these are cute. Are they my size? Size nine. All right. These are by Mud. Size nine. Just a really, really cool wash on these shorts. Has the frayed hems. I really wish these would fit me. They might. Probably not. It's okay. It's okay. I don't need any more shorts anyways, but I love those. Bag number one, done. We have light wash, medium light wash, Levi's low boot cut, 545s, size 10S. we go, Levi's. Ooh. Instead of me telling you guys what I think I'm going to be getting for all these jeans, I'm just going to be doing what sold video for you guys because I might price it at something else and then I might change my mind a few days later and change the price or I might just accept an offer or they might sell for the price I'm asking. It's just I don't want to... I don't want to give you the wrong price if I'm going to say, oh, I can get 20 for these and I'm actually going to get like 14, 15. Like I, I, I think that's not very helpful at all by just guessing. So keep, I, keep, your eye not, <laughs> keep an eye out for when I do my what sold videos. By the way, I've already sold my Wrangler jeans for my last video. I will tell you guys about that at the end. We have American Eagle Outfitters. Made to last, medium wash. Let's see what size, 29 by 32. These are slim straights. Feels like men's, but yeah. Yeah. Has a little distressing on the back pockets. I'll show that in a second. And it's whiskering. Yeah, some distressing on the back pockets, but that's okay. Underground Soul, size 9. I really, really like the wash on these. I haven't heard of this brand before. Underground Soul, size 9. I'm going to do a little bit of research on that just to get familiar with the brand. But I don't think I'll have a problem selling these just because of the wash on them, the sandblasting. It just looks really nice. Ooh. American Eagle, got some American Eagle shorts. I like this 
bleached acid wash type of style has the cool studding embellish it's distressed got the American Eagle logo for you guys and this is size 10 so already the wash on it the embellishments the size the brand the distressing this is going to sell really quickly maybe not like during Christmas I might just wait to post this until like the beginning of the next season but I don't think I'll have a problem at all selling this everything hits the mark very on trend very okay dark wash apartment 9 boot cut size 12 pretty sure these are women's because the embellishments on the pockets are pretty obvious <laughs> on that and the size there we go we got the nice sandblast there these are my favorite favorite kind of like pattern is the sandblast with the whiskering and the dark wash these are my favorite so there we go I really like the back pockets nothing crazy but still embellished so it doesn't hurt when you sit down that's what I think of when people buy stuff that's like heavily embellished in the back pockets it's like does that hurt that's just me. we have is that Tasso Bella Tasso Ella I think that's Tasso Ella okay let me do you see that 34W, 30 long. This is a straight leg. All right, dark wash. See, definitely men's. Thought so with the size. Nice, nice dark wash. I don't really see any distressing happening. This is still in really, really great condition. Haven't sold this before or heard of this brand, so I'm pretty excited to check those out. We have Lane Bryant. I got a pair of Lane Bryant's in my last haul that I've already gotten a lot of likes on, on my Poshmark, some watchers. I did get an offer on it, but it was way too low. So, unfortunately, when I countered, they declined. But here we go. Nice, very nice. That wear right there. Whiskering, capris. It has the cuffed hems. Cuffed, factory, factory cuffed. <laughs> Here we go. This is a size 18, by the way. And then you got this nice embroidery on the back pockets. We have a pair of uh, Levi's 515 boot cut, dark wash, size 4 short. Love the wash on this as well. Really great condition. Not too much distressing. Minor distressing on the pockets. On the pocket hems. Yeah. I really like that wash though. It has like a, almost like a brown tone to it. Wow. Tiny. So tiny. Oh my goodness. Short shorts. I'm probably going to put booty shorts in the title because this is like booty shorts. The inseam is approximately an inch and a half. An inch and a half. Look at that. Maybe. If we're lucky, two inches. <laughs> Maybe. Wow. All right. Well, this is Hollister. All right. This is a size one. This is going to be a really slow sell, so I'm going to try and post this as soon as possible. When the season changes, I like that back pocket. I mean, the front pocket. Can you see that? There we go. That's cute. Not like anybody's gonna see it when they're wearing it, but that's cute still. Has nice distressing, frayed hems, very on trend. That's a really cool embroidered pocket. That's really cool detail on these. Another pair of shorts, American Eagle size. Size 12, live your life. So we have the distressed shorts with the frayed hems, whiskering, distressed pockets. It's a decent size. These are all a lot quicker than my, sh my smaller sizes, I believe. Okay. 
Okay, wow, nice, wow. I'm loving the distress on this. It's just super distressed, nice. Would this be considered destroyed? Because there's so many holes, but the holes aren't like that big. I still might put destroyed, maybe. Hmm. Question, do you guys put only distressed or do you guys put like distressed and destroyed or just destroyed when it comes to things like this? That's, that's a curious question because whenever I'm up in the air about it, I usually put both. <laughs> distressed and destroyed. Why not have it pick up on both keywords? But this is American Eagle Outfitters size for jeggings. I could have told you that without looking. Has ooh, nice dark wash with stress, sandblast. Little slight distressing on the back pockets, faded butt. That's definitely going to sell on Poshmark almost right away. Anytime I put destroyed or, or distressed jeans on Poshmark, it sells faster than the other ones in the same brand. All right, we have Wrangler jeans and co. Relax straight, medium wash, I would say. Here we go. Did I tell you the size? No, I didn't. <laughs> this is a 33 by 30 men's, All right? Right? Pocket? Yep. Men's. Denizen from Levi's. Did I say that right? Denizen. Hmm. These are really soft. Really soft denim. This is a size four. Shorts. These aren't factory cuffed, I don't think. Oh, they are. Ooh, that's cool. Yeah, factory cuffed. Mm. Light wash, medium light wash. I wanna see what it looks like when it's a little bit brighter in here. It's been raining all day, so my lighting in here sucks. And I really wanted to take pictures today, but I've learned my lesson when it's raining out, my pictures do not look good. So when I'm in, in between on a color or a wash, I look at it in the sunlight. Relax straight, 559 Levi's. These are definitely men's, 36 by 34. Ooh, I really like this wash too. I am loving all the dark wash, Mike, thanks. I actually really enjoy taking pictures and listing dark wash because I love them the most. Light wash and medium wash I'm not that excited about, but they still sell. Got a little distressing on the hems, that's okay. This is not factory done. But um, about half my jeans I've sold on Poshmark. I know it's weird, but even on Poshmark, the frayed hems still sell. Ooh, interesting. This is like a red acid wash look. It's not acid wash, but it's, it's what an acid wash would look like if it was red. That's the best way to say it in person because, can you see that wash a little bit? Yeah, stretchy waist. This is rude. <laughs> Size small. There we go. Rude. Stretchy waist. It has the, the waist strings. These are like a Bermuda short length. It has the frayed hems. Let's see, definitely a men's. Maybe, no. Maybe. Actually, yeah. I would, yeah, these are men's. My hand's sticking like super far in there. I've never heard of this, never seen a pair like this. Has the pockets. That's cool. I like getting things I've never heard of. Oh wow, I'm getting super washed out. But the color on the jeans is actually acting pretty accurate for what's in real life. We have, I think, one more pair in this bag. Yeah, one more pair in this bag. Dark wash, premium boot cut, gap, size six, 28 regular women's. I don't even have to put my pocket in there to let you know, but I will just to double check like I always do. Definitely. We have the sandblast. Nice. Not, not like major sandblast. I might not put that in the title, but slight. Nice. 
I don't see much distressing at all. Just a lot of little, little threads, but no distressing. These are in excellent condition. Number two done. We have one more bag. Our last bag. Ooh, U.S. Polo Association Authentic Denim Co. I'm reading that tag if you're wondering what I was looking at. It's a big tag. I haven't seen a tag like this yet in real life. This is size 42. Shorts. Men's maybe. No. Women's. Definitely women's. Should have known by the size. But I don't see any distressing. Nope. I feel like this fading looks pretty factory, but yeah, this look like in a really excellent condition, really excellent size. Nice. I've been really wanting to get more plus size stuff in my store, especially in my eBay to help my sales get up you know, come a little quicker. So I'm excited about these. Even though there's a lot of shorts and capris and it's December, I'm still really happy because when it comes to that season, I have a lot of like free-ish inventory to list during those months. We have Massimo denim, mid-rise denim leggings, size double zero, medium wash, women's, Double zero. Oh my god, so tiny. So tiny. But super cute. Nice basic jeans. I don't see any distressing. Still has the, the stretchiness to it. Ooh. Ooh, super dark wash. Sonoma. All right, Sonoma, we have a size four petite. Look at that. This is a flare. I feel like this is a flare. Not quite the boot. I feel like, yeah, this is gonna be like a flare. But this is cute. Very nice condition. I don't see much wear at all. Excellent condition again. Another dark wash, mud. Mud actually sells pretty good for me. Really nice wash. Nice flare bottom there. That's definitely flare. Slight distress. This is a size nine juniors. Yeah, like most of my mud that I have listed. I really like these back pockets. Really nice. So I'm definitely going to show this in my picture when I'm listing to show that it is a, let me see if I can show you how I kind of take pictures like this so they can see it's a flare, they can see the cool detail. That's probably going to be like how I list it right there. <laughs> All right, this is cool. We have Piper and Blue, size 13. Women's capris. <laughs> Look at all, okay, these are awesome. Oh, these are gonna photograph so well. It comes with the belt. I feel like these haven't even been worn. The tag doesn't look messed up. This is what the tag looks like. I don't know if it's gonna show you. Oh, oh, do you see it? Maybe. All right. Well, it comes with the belt. The belt doesn't even look like it's been worn. It feels real stiff. Same with the pants. What is that? Oh, something that was on the jeans came right off. But look how cool that looks. It's like paint splatter. Definitely going to put that in my description. Cool embroidered pockets. So 90s early 2000s to me this is what that's what it's screaming to me even though these look brand new so definitely probably a newer one but that's what it reminds me of booty shorts booty 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 rocking everywhere american eagle stretch women's shorts size six and it has the 
oh my god, these are so lightweight. I'm so not used to it. But it has the cut hem. Not quite frayed. Cropped hem. Yeah, it has the distressing in the front and the back. Mm, medium wash. Dark wash. Levi's. 515, oh sorry, 514's. 33 by 32 men's. Yep. Well, the dark material really likes to make the light wash me out, but it makes the, the clothing look great. Nice embroidered pockets. I feel like I have a pair of these listed in my closet already. Um, and if I'm remembering correctly, I have already gotten an offer for it that I had accepted, but there was like a payment issue, so I haven't actually sold it yet. But if I remember correctly, I sold it for $18. So that's cool. Ooh. Get a piece of hair stuck on these. There we go. Ooh, I really like these pockets. You see that really cool embroidered? Oh, it's Xanady. That's how I pronounce it. Xanady. Xanady. I actually got a pair of these. Um, I don't know if it was my last haul. It was. I think it was the haul before that because it was new tags. And they were a pair of pink shorts from Xanady. I feel like I could sell these for, I'm gonna play it easy, 15. But since these are not new with tags, maybe I'll go with 14 or 13. But that is what's going to sell them. That is going to be my, my, um, my main picture. Get people to click on it, I love that. And it looks like, it just has a little bit of loose threading not bad, not not anything to ruin it, and it looks like all the embellishments, yeah, all the embellishments are there. So I should not have a, a problem selling these. Those are super cute. Light wash, yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Oh my god, this is is this new attacks? Dang it, no, I want. It. I think I, I think I might wear this once before sending it off. I keep the tag on it. Would that be bad? Yeah, that would be bad. Okay, I won't do it. I won't do it. This is Wallflower. Brand new with tags. I'll show you this tag. Might be easier. Is it easier? Maybe not. Oh, here we go. Wallflower. It's a denim vest with a very, very soft hood. Oh my god, I love this. This is awesome. Oh my god. It's a little small on me, so I'm definitely not gonna be able to even wear this once. It's like a little too small on me. I think this is my favorite thing in this box though. Oh my God, yes. Oh crap, my coffee, my coffee. All right. Yeah, pretty nice. Yeah, definitely my favorite. It's a size small. I wish it was a medium, but oh, let me bring my chair back up. Okay. But it's very soft fleece. Oh, that's why. Maybe I can get this out with OxyClean. There's some stainage on the. I might be able to get this out with OxyClean. I don't think it. I don't think it's actually a stain. It looked like a bleach stain at first, but I might be able to get it out. If I can't. I'll still sell it, but I might only just put it on eBay, not on Poshmark. We'll see. It's originally $48, so the color is, the color is Ashley. Ashley is the color. But if I can get that staining out, I could probably sell this for a good $24. $20 if you play your cards right. But if I can't, I might only be able to sell it for $10. All right, this is, ooh, polka dots. Ooh, all right, this is a pair of Indigo Rain Forever is what they're called. 
Indigo Rain forever. I have sold a pair of Indigo Rain before. These are juniors, I can already tell, size nine, yes. I sold these, not these pair, this pair, but a distressed dark denim, I believe for $15 on Poshmark, and I believe it was a size nine as well. And these are really cool. It has like felt almost um, polka dots. And it's not your normal denim feel. I really like these skinny jeans. I'm probably going to list these today and put these in her closet and see if she wants another pair of Invigo Rain size 9. She did say that she would love to buy from my closet again. So this might just be a really quick, easy, fast sell. Ooh, we got some uh, floral action happening, like a Hawaiian feel to it. What is this? Jamaica Bay, Discover Paradise, new tags. That's cool. Thanks, Mike. Oh, but can you can you see it? There we go. New tags has an extra button. Is it gonna? Is it gonna show the? Button? It doesn't really matter. It's not gonna show the button. But I'm trying to stuff from the from the vest still. All right. Jamaica Bay stretch size twelve. Women's. Let me. There we go. Capri pants. Really nice, cool Hawaiian, Jamaican. Sorry, I'm gonna put Jamaican floral in the title. Yeah. Let's see. This was new at tags for forty dollars. I'm gonna try and get a good twenty out of them. 25 if I'm lucky. Probably list them at 25, but I'll probably accept 20. We have American Eagle Outfitters Extreme Flex. I definitely have another pair of these in my closet already. These are Slim Taper 29 by 32. There we go. It does have like a Deep pockets like it's men's. These might just be very small men's, but it, oh, it has a style of like a woman. I'm just gonna look at these closer when I'm not doing this haul video. Most of the time when it's waist by length, it's men's, but like I said, it just feels like woman's. It's probably men's. We have American Eagle a Dark Wash Artist Fit. Size zero. This is exciting. I haven't sold the artist fit yet. And these are like a capri. Has nice, very nice sandblasting with the sand blasting <laughs> with the whiskering. Go slight distressing, but that looks factory distress. So that's just a nice added detail. We have hmm, like an acid wash. Yep, dark acid wash. Tinseltown, size one, Tinseltown, size one. Haven't heard this brand yet, haven't sold it, but I like it. It has stretch to it, nice skinny jean. I love these, actually. <laughs> oh, I wish these were my size. I, ha I don't have anything like this in my closet, and if they were my size, I would for sure keep them, but they're too small. Size one, Tinseltown. Yep. Yes! Okay, so I'm pretty sure I had a pair of Wranglers earlier, and this is my second pair in this box, meaning third pair of Wranglers in this order. Like I said, I listed a pair of Wranglers, and five hours later, they sold. So I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna get these listed. I might not be that lucky and get another five hour sale, but I'm loving selling Wrangler right now. So this is a size 30 by 34 dark wash men's Wrangler. There we go. Has the W embroidered on the back, has the Wrangler twice right here and right there. Really great condition. I don't see any wear. I don't see any distressing. 
it feels still really, um, really stiff. So it doesn't feel like they were worn very much. I'm really excited to get these listed. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh I see some more embellishments. Earl Jean. So it has some really nice embellishments. It has the Earl tag right there. Earl. Haven't heard of these or sold these yet, but I'm loving the embellishments. Look at that. Oh, so glittery. These are a size eight. Eh, medium, dark wash. It's like right, right in between. Has some cool whiskering. Look at that. So shiny. All right, it looks like everything is on here all the embellishments yes it has like lace embellished into it too so I'm definitely going to make this my photo pick to really make people curious about those these kind of pants because of the how pretty the pockets look we have dark wash American Eagle stretch size 12 shorts these are a longer short these have the frayed hems these are very very nice I love 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 how dark wash these are and the pattern of the whiskering we have Tommy Hilfiger I haven't been able to find Tommy Hilfiger I haven't been able to find Tommy Hilfiger jeans when outsourcing myself, so I don't have anything Tommy Hilfiger in my in my closet or in my store. These are size 34 by 32s. Oh, these feel like men's. Yeah, the pockets are in there. The size is by waist and height. There we go. pockets just simple sleek got the Tommy he'll figure 85 if I hadn't shown you the tag it's the typical Tommy he'll figure tag all right wow this chair is just so so loud <laughs> we have I like how big these are already patchwork Ashley Seward Ashley <clears throat> Ashley Stewart <laughs> size 22 I do have a pair of Ashley Stewart size 22 already listed in my closet and in my store they haven't sold yet but hey it's only been a week so but these are a light wash destroyed but has patchwork all over I wonder if these are factory done Interesting. I can't tell. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look at these a little bit more whenever I'm not doing this video to to really inspect it, but it looks very, very destroyed, distressed, patched up. Nice slim leg right there. Really great size. I really like the, the patchwork distressing on them, so this is gonna be very interesting to list. We have American Eagle Outfitters Stretch, size 14 shorts, women's. Again, frayed hems, distressing, ba bam. We have Capri's NYNC. So this is New York and Co. Slim. Slim crop, low rise Capri's. Has the factory cuffed hem. There we go. Still excellent condition. I don't see any distressing or wear around the pocket. So, excellent condition. Oh no, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Ooh. Another denim jacket, guys. I haven't sold any of the denim jackets yet that I've got I've received, but hey, it's 
it's still winter. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. We have Christopher and Bank, size large. Come in. Come in. Oh, do you see it? Okay. But this has like really cool hemline work. And I like the buttons, the floral buttons. Do you see it? Oh, there we go. I like the medium wash here. It is obviously too long, too big for me. It's a large. But it's still, here we go. Best way to show y'all. Still really good condition. A little bit of wear. But it's definitely an in-trend look. Because the, the, the fray, not the fray, it's the, the scrunchiness. <laughs> I'm going to think of the better word whenever I'm not videoing this. But like the scrunchiness pattern of like the hem is very, very in right now. Especially on like long sleeve, um, sleeve work and things like that. <clears throat> American Eagle Outfitters. Super stretch. High rise jegging. Size 14, short. Let me tuck in these packets for ya. Da -da -da. Got, got some whole action there. Maybe not destroyed, but definitely distressed, but definitely still on trend. There we go. Pretty decent size. Typical American Eagle pockets. And this is our last pair. This is our last pair of denim. I have no more denim to show you after this. All right, so these are a pair of, wow, there's like no name on these anywhere. Denim, it just says denim. Skinny low waist, size 25, 32 by H&M. Okay, it's right there on the tag at the very bottom. Do you see that? Right there. <laughs> Not on here. Not on here. Button is blank. That was... <laughs> That's funny. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can see it now. It has the and sign on here, which means it's H&M. Anyways, uh, these are a nice medium dark wash, jegging type of material. Stretchy. Not a heavy denim, very thin denim. No distressing. I don't see very much wear around the waist. Very, very light wear. Hardly looks used. Excellent, excellent condition. These should sell really good. There's no more. No more. <laughs> I didn't actually like go through the ring light like I thought it would to go past the camera. It just kind of hit the camera. Anyways, so that is the end of my part two of my denim wholesale order from Pittsburgh Mike. Thank you very much, Mike. I got a lot of really great stuff that I'm really, really pleased about. I did get a lot of capris and shorts, which I'm not really not that upset about because I can just make sure to put that away and I'll have plenty of inventory for when the new season comes out. Uh, a lot of dark wash, which are definitely my favorite thing to list, so I'm pretty excited about that, as well as the sizes. I got a lot of plus size or a lot bigger than just the zeros, twos, fours, which I did receive in my last box and what is really easily accessible around me. So that's nice to be able to receive, as well as more men's clothing. Men's sells really well for me on Poshmark because there's not a huge competition for it. Um, Especially with jeans, they sell really, really well. So I'm very, very pleased with my order again. If you guys wanna buy any wholesale denim lot orders, I'm gonna link uh, Pittsburgh Mike's Instagram in the description for you guys as well. He usually posts whenever he's ready to sell. Some he does it by 25, 50, and 100 um, orders. The price varies with shipping included um, because he does it by 
distance, I guess, how far away you are from him. So the price will vary with the shipping. I'm really, really pleased with what I got and I'm really excited to start listing. So I'm gonna go ahead and start that. Don't forget to subscribe. I will have my what sold videos out. I do want to start doing those, maybe not every week, but maybe every two weeks. We'll see how that goes. But at least you can see what is actually selling as of right now on Poshmark and eBay. And don't forget to hit that bell button next to the subscribe button to get a notification anytime I post. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.